Okay guys, it's here. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or if you guys are new hello welcome my name is Aspen I'm glad to have you nice nice to meet you so in today's video clearly by the title that I am clearly very excited for I'm gonna be doing my Kylie lip kit unboxing I haven't never ordered from Kylie cosmetics before and she just came out with four new fall shades and right whenever I saw that picture on Instagram, I knew that I had to get my hands on these lip kits. I've heard so many mixed reviews about them, so I didn't know if they were really worth the money. But within five minutes, I had my order complete. I had them. This is going to be part two of my fall liquid lipstick video. My first one was of Jeffree Star Cosmetics, so I will have that link down below and probably have like some something on the screen for it as well. So if you guys are new, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you like this video. I ordered them the day they came out, which I believe was October 12th. The shipping for me, um, I live in Texas. And they ship from California, so it only took five days to get here, which was pretty impressive. The time has come. I finally get to open it. I'm so excited. I got my handy dandy scissors. <laughs> I'm literally living. I have to put this on Snapchat. Give me a sec. So if you guys have, I'm pretty sure you all have, but if you guys have never seen like an unboxing video of any Kylie lip kits, um, of course the box says Kylie on it and then on the top it says Kylie Cosmetics and then you get a little like photo card that has a message on the back and obviously this is not like hand written. And then next comes the lip kits. Oh my gosh this is so like surreal that I'm holding lip kits in my hand. But I got two of the lip kits. I got Moon and Spice. So overall with the like box itself. And then the boxes of the um, lip kits, I think that they are great. They really do represent Kylie. I've heard so many mixed reviews about Kylie Cosmetics, so I was like, I just need to test it out myself. Like, I'm not going to be a follower, and this is what everybody else says. Do what I want. So I'm going to move you guys in a little closer so we can test out these Kylie lip kits. So obviously these are liquid lipsticks, so... They are a little bit dry. The first one I'm going to be trying is Moon. And she does have like tips on the back that says for the best results. Fill in your lips with the lip liner. Then top with one coat of the matte liquid lipstick. So these lip kits come with... Oh, there we go. These lip kits come with a lip liner and a liquid lipstick. I've heard that the lip liner is amazing. And people compare it to the Urban Decay lip liner. It does smell just like cupcakes, like everybody says it does. It smells like, I want to say buttercream frosting. That's what it reminds me of. So I'm going to follow her instructions and put on the lip liner and then the liquid lipstick. Let's do it. Okay. So I did my best with the lip liner, and the color is pretty. Yeah, I really like the color of this lip liner. Let's put this on my lips. Okay, I'm literally living for this color. I'm not even kidding. It's like a purple tone color, but it's a very like ashy gray purple tone color. And I think this color is perfect for the fall and winter seasons. It's drying very quickly and it is not tacky at all. The only thing I do not like about them is the doe foot applicator. I like Jeffree's a lot better just because they are much bigger. So I feel like they hold a lot more product. This one I had to go in twice to get some more product to put on my lips. But yeah, it is completely dry now and it literally feels like there's nothing on my lips. Like, is this a joke? This one's a little harder to get off. Now that I got that off, the next one we are going to be trying is Spice. And when I saw this on her Instagram, I, lit I knew I had to pick this color up. Wow, this lip liner is so pigmented. Oh 
I honestly did a terrible job at lining my lips, but oh well. It is looking a little patchy, but I'm going to let it dry to see if it dries completely patchy. So, unfortunately it is drying patchy, but I feel like if I just used more product, which isn't really ideal, but if you use more product, I feel like it won't dry as patchy. There's only some areas, like kind of right here, here, um, and then it is kind of patchy on my bottom lip, which is kind of disappointing now I know kind of what people are talking about I do really like this color it is a very very beautiful like plummy purpley berry color for the fall y'all I'm lit so lit like I'm so pleased so that is gonna be it for my Kylie who's Kylie so that is going to be it for my Kylie lip kit unboxing. I am so pleased with both of her lip kits. Even though Spice is a little patchy, um, I feel like I can find some way to make it not as patchy um, and still wearable. I forgot to say at the beginning, but her lip kits run for $29 and I think it's pretty worth it because they come with a liquid lipstick and a lip liner and if you go to like Ulta or Sephora and get both of those, it's roughly around the same price, maybe a little bit more expensive. So I think that her lip kits are definitely worth the money worth the hype down to the packaging the scent the product itself I am definitely a fan I'm so excited that I finally got to try them out myself some people may get bad products these ain't bad products so now if you guys are wondering which one I would prefer more Jeffree Star Cosmetics or Kylie Cosmetics I honestly would say that they're both a tie they both have their pros and cons in my opinion so I think that they are both worth the hype worth the money like treat yourself like go buy you some Lore liquid lipsticks and Kylie lip kits because that's what I did. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching my fall liquid lipstick kind of series. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!